And here's our pulled pork adobo with basmati fried rice and cucumber salad. Hello, I'm Richard Gomez and welcome to Guam at Home. Today we are preparing comfort food. Ano ba mga comfort food natin mga Pinoy? Of course, adobo is number one. So today what we're going to do is uh, we are making pulled pork adobo. And then, kawin natin siya ng garlic rice using basmati rice. Ito, ziba. We're making on the side cucumber salad. Okay? Sige. So, pag mag-prepare tayo ng adobo, ano ba yung basics natin adobo? Of course, the basic of adobo is good soy sauce, good vinegar, uh, pepper, and bay leaves. Yan ang basic natin sa adobo. So, lagyan mo ng konti tubig para mas, uh, mas may sauce siya. Depends on, on how you, you want to do it. Di ba naman? Pag sinabi ng adobong puti, walang soy sauce. No? So, yun, adobong puti. There's so many variants and varieties of, uh, of adobo. No? So, sa atin, always we go back to the basics. Okay, so gagawin ko muna is, nalinisan ko na lahat ito, nahugasan na lahat, and we are preparing our pork. Ang kinamit natin dito, kasi nga, pulled pork, uh, There way, there are different kinds of meat na pwede mo gamitin. Pwede gumamit ng kasim, yun dito. Yung uh, pigi ng baboy, pwede yan. Para pang pulled pork, pwede rin tenderloin para mas malambot. Okay? So, yun ang muna ang gagawin natin. Ito ka. Tuloy natin. May knife. So, I'm just sharing my knife. Putuloy natin yung... Uh, tenderloin natin. So, gusto mo ng pulled pork, pero gusto mo rin na medyo may strands ng konti. So, habaan natin yung, yung pork natin. So, ito, medyo, pag ginawa natin to, medyo tedious lang ng konti because after cooking this, syempre, palalamigin mo ng konti and then, i-ano mo siya, i-hiwalay mo siya. Hindi mo na kailangan tanggalin yung mga litid niya because pag niluto mo siya, lalambutin yung litid niya, magbe-breakdown yan, okay na ulit yan. Alright? Ayan. So, putuloy mo lang siya na ganito kalaki. Para pag nag-strand ka, medyo mahaba yung yung pork pieces mo. Okay. Nice. There you go. Alright. Nilagyan natin itong baboy natin dito. Okay. Put it here. Good. Yeah. So, ang unay natin, kasi medyo matagal itong process, we'll cook this for about, uh, about an hour para talagang mag, -mag break down. Lagyan mo natin ng tubig. Okay? Just your water. Next is, good soy sauce. Okay? I give you some soy sauce. So this is your uh, source of salt na rin. No? Okay. Good. That's good. And then, again ng pepper. Put in lots of pepper. Yun. Okay. Suka. Yan. Ano ba ang adobo pag wala suka? Hindi adobo ang tawag doon. Yan. Yan. Maraming suka. Yes. Sakto. And bay leaves. Alright. Damihan mo na rin para malasa talaga. Hmm. Good. And we let this boil. Yan. We let this simmer for about 45 minutes to 1 hour. Depende kung gano'n siya kalambot. Okay? So, while we're doing that, of course, our last element para sa ating uh, adobo is lots of garlic. No? Lalagay ko na kagad yung garlic. And lots of garlic. Yan, sarap. That's the way to do it. So, we'll mix this. Mix-mix lang yan. Okay. 
And then, siguro what I'll do now, para medyo may sweet element siya, lagyan natin siya ng ano, lagyan natin siya ng uh, onions, no? So we have onions here. Okay. Yun. Kasi onions, pag naluto, matamis siya eh. So para medyo matamis ng konti adobo because it's Valentine's, no? So pag Valentine's, sweet tayo lahat. Okay? At alam nyo ba, data shows na pag Valentine's Day, ano yan, talagang yun yung one of the most uh, celebrated uh, events all over the world. Talaga ang laki ng, ano, ang laki ng uh, spending, laki ng ginagastos ng mga tao when it comes to, to Valentine's. So, yan. So, lagyan natin siya ng sibuyas. Okay? Para damihan na natin kasi mura ng sibuyas ngayon. Yung Put more? Put more. Sige. Okay. And then, we'll just uh, mix it and then cover it. Alright. In a while, lalagyan ko lang ito ng konti pang tubig. And then, we'll wait for about 45 minutes. On the 30th minute, it check natin siya kung, kung okay na. Okay? So in the meantime, gawa tayo cucumber salad. Ito yung on the side natin. Okay? Uh, I need a container for this. Don't. Hindi na kailangan ito i-peel. So what we'll do, gawa tayo ng uh, ganyan lang. Well, about an inch. No? And so ito yung pinaka-salad natin. There go. Okay. Okay, brush it down. Yeah. Okay. So, putol natin yung cucumber natin. Ang gagawin natin, we'll make it sweat no? by putting lots of uh, putting lots of salt. Yan. Tapos, pag may salt na yan, haluin mo lang siya. Magtutubig yan, lalabas siya. No? Idodraw out ng, ano, idodraw out ng, uh, ng salt yung moisture ng, ng cucumber. Ito mo, ginaganto ko pa lang. Oh. Basa na kaagad. So, we'll do this for about 5 minutes. Bilis lang. And then we'll wash it. Pagkatapos natin i-wash, tutuyo naman natin siya dun sa ano, dun sa paper towel. Okay? Okay? So after na siya i-massage na, no? In about 5 minutes, makita mo yung cucumber niya, nagsisweat na siya. So what I'll do now, I'll just go out and uh, wash this para tanggalin ko lang yung salt. So now our cucumbers are washed. Kuha lang tayo na, no? Ng uh, kitchen towel. At tutuyin natin yung cucumber natin. Okay. Okay. Kailangan tuyo na siya dito. Before naan siya, ilagay, gawa na ano, gawa ng pinaka pickle sauce niya. Alright. Tuyo na. Once patuyo na siya, ibabalik ko na siya ulit dito. So for the pickles, gagawin natin, uh, we'll, we'll put in some, some garlic, okay, there, 
And then, lagyan natin ng crushed uh, pepper. This. Okay. And then, lagyan natin ng crushed black pepper. And then yung uh, yung oil natin, what I'll do is I'll heat it up, no? Mag maglalayo nito para yun ang ilalagay nandi to to half cook the the garlic and the other ingredients. And then lalagyan natin mamaya ng honey and a little of uh, vinegar, okay? And the uh, sesame oil. There you go. So yung sesame oil, pwede ka nang lagyan to dito. Hmm? So yung flavor nito. Okay, so what I'll do, I'll heat up some, some oil. Okay. Using our Doña Elena pure olive oil. There you go. Wow. Sarap, oh. Then once mainit na mainit na to, ipopour natin dun. Okay. Good. There's more. So what we'll do is heat up our Doña Elena pure olive oil. And it only take about mga two to three minutes para uminit talaga siya ng gusto. Lagyan na natin ng salt. Not too much. Kasi yung cucumber medyo of course, salted na yun. Although, nilinis na natin siya, inugasa natin siya. Let's mix this. So, you can see na mainit na talaga yung oil natin. And that's the time we pour it here. Okay? Give me about 20 more seconds. Para talaga mainit na mainit yung oil. Okay, I'll put it here. There you go. And then just mix it. Yan. Okay. Good. Hmm. And from there, lagyan siya ng konting vinegar. Yan. Good. Then let's mix it again. And then taste it. Okay. Hindi ko pa ilalagay yung ano. Hindi ko pa ilalagay yung yung honey. I'll try it first before I put in the honey. Hmm. Good. I'll put the honey now. Tama ni yung sourness niya. And then, nagyan ng honey, syempre. Pag pickles, kailangan sweet and sour and a little spicy. I'll mix it well. So you notice, mainit talaga to. The oil is very hot, and then we put this all here. Okay? And then we let it marinate. Yun. Yun lang. Mmm. Good. So leave it here. Until matapos tayo magluto. And then, ito yung side dish natin. One final check. Tignan natin kung malamot na talaga yung adobo natin. Yun. Okay, good. Malamot na ba talaga? And then... and dalawang tinidor and this what we'll do separate na natin sinagano yun tama mo humok talaga oh. so medyo tedious lang ng konti ito pero ganun talaga eh when you serve your food with love do it carefully 
Yun, and full of love. So, mainit, no? Kaya kailangan, gamit na mo talaga ng tinidor. Yan. After this, i-refry -re naman natin siya. Yun. So, yan. So, that's your pulled pork. Using tenderloin. So, after shredding our pork, yan na, pulled pork na siya. Ayan, tatabi natin to. Okay. And then we'll make this, we'll fry this in uh, Doña Elena oil, no olive oil, siempre, together with uh, lots of garlic. So, ready ko na yung pan. Ito, hindi na siya masyado mainit. So, pwede na dito. Yung pinaglutuo natin, yung sauce, gagamitin natin sa mamaya. Okay. There you go. So, this one, we will fry this with lots of garlic, of course, and Doña Elena. Okay, pure olive oil. Oil here. So, meron tayong sauce dito, di ba? Kanina. Yan. Sama na lang siya dito. Yun. And leave some for the rice also. Yun! Okay. Kumukulo na siya. Mainit na yung oil natin. We'll put in more garlic. Yan. Put in more garlic. Cook the garlic a little more. Yun. Ganda. Tapos, i-refry -re natin yung i-refry -re natin yung uh, itong uh, adobo natin. Nice. Give it about 5 minutes. Pag naluto na yung yung garlic, bagsak natin yung yung pulled pork natin, yun. Tapos, ganun eh, pag-serve mo, i-refry mo lang. Yun. Nice. So, this already seasoned. What you just want this is to refry it para medyo Lumutong, mat uh, matuyo lang siya ng konti. Ayan. Ayan. Good. They are until maging crispy one side. And then mix it. Let, para mag crispy ulit. And ready na. I put a little more Doña Elena pure olive oil. Yun. Yan. Para mas maganda yung pagka tostado niya. 5-5 minutes, then we're done. So now dry na yung ano natin. Dry na yung uh, pulled pork adobo natin. Talay siya dito. Oh, look at that. Ganda. Ito, that's all, this one, that's all flavor. So, ang gagawin ko, kasi nakadikit siya. Do this. And then, see that? So, we'll just let it boil. No? And then, habang nagbo-boil siya, ilalagyan natin ng garlic. Getting ready for the fried rice. Yeah. Nice. Tapos yung yung naiwan natin na sauce dun sa sa lutuan natin kanina. Yan. 
ilalagyan natin yung dito yun yan that's for the fried rice Just let it cook let it cook we'll put in our basmati rice Then mix lang na mix. Ayan. Para may incorporate lang yung sauce. No? Then lagyan natin ng Doña Elena olive oil. Pure olive oil. Ayan. Good. Then pang finishing touch ko. Konting konti lang na sesame oil and, and this one for added flavor for the rice a little more yeah. and then continue mixing it I'll start plating pork adobo ang ginawa natin kanina na cucumber salad we'll put this on the side and here's our pulled pork adobo with basmati fried rice and cucumber salad Hello guys, there you go. Pwede. <laughs> Enjoy this comfort food. Yan. Mm. Well, Doña Elena has been part of our regular ingredients that we have natin dito sa Tagoma at home. It's been very good. Really good. Of course, my favorite, coconut water. Very good for you, Mr. Kabili. Yes, sir. Sarap mm -hmm. ng I love the salad. The salad, that. Uh, Meron ng olive oil na Doña Elena. Yes. Thank you for the company. Thank you for. Thank yeah. you for lunch. Happy, happy, happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's. Tonight, kami naman ni, ni Lucy ang kasama, no? Yes, di ba? Uh, thank you so much for joining me right here in Gomat Home. I hope you uh, enjoyed this this, uh, this recipe. So. Do it in your own kitchen, share it with your friends, enjoy it with your family. Thanks so much. I'll see you soon. Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. Thank you, Congressman. Yes, sir. <laughs> Yum. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>